assalamu alaikum hello everyone uh, today we will talk about uh, grammatical rules again and uh, as you know if we want to learn and if you we want to speak craft english then uh, we should learn uh, the grammatical rules and these grammatical rules are very important if we want to be a uh, uh, fluent speaker in english language or if we want to learn english in a correct way then we should know and we should understand these grammatical rules so uh, we take it in a very serious way and we should take it in a very serious way uh, grammar is very important if somebody says to you that no if you want to learn english then there is no need of grammar i think that is incorrect you should know the grammar it is very important so uh, here we start our lesson first is have you got dog yes i got a nice dog so th there are four options has have are am uh, so correct option is have why because we always use have when we use i second has she got a cat no she has not she has not got a cat so has not become hasn't so option c is correct hasn't or has not as you know uh, we use has with he she it or if we talk about any singular noun option number three has the house got a garden yes it has a nice garden so here it is it and you know the rule is that we should use has with it so there is has option number b is correct uh, uh, next question number four this dog is nice it is a nice dog as we say this dog is nice so the correct option is it is a nice dog first it is the adjective and then is the noun that is dog as you know that uh, we put nice that is adjective we put adjective before the noun so we should say nice dog question number five has mrs green a table has mrs green a table so this is interrogative yes she has a white table so we will use has because there is she so she has a white table option number six it is 8 a.m it is 8 a.m good morning it is 8 a.m good morning as uh, when you listen to the news on radio or television and uh, the news anchor uh, starts his news bulletin with 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 this line it is 8 a.m good morning it is 3 p.m it is 3 p.m good afternoon so 3 p.m after 3 p.m there is time which is afternoon so we are talking about p.m it is 3 p.m afternoon have you got a chair no i haven't got a chair so there is haven't with the contraction of have not then there is the option has mr smith got a house yes she has got a nice house same rule is there and option number 10 the room two windows the room now because room is singular 
so we will use has we always use has with singular and we put have with plural so the room has two windows this this was the whole story of has and have and uh, mm, uh, the, the, cut the story short and if we want to learn it the rule if we want to learn the rule of using a has or have then we should keep in mind that uh, I we you and they take have as their helping verb and he she it use take has as a helping verb so these are the helping verbs of present perfect tense and we use always has or have when we use present perfect but the question is where we should use has and where we should use have we can use have with with plural or with i we you and they we can use have with these four pronouns and when we use has then we should have he she it our singular noun as a subject so this is uh, this was the today's video uh, about has and have thank you very much